We are going to make our country great again. The RNC convention is in town. The eyes have it. You are ignoring delegates who have been elected to this convention. 400 years of slavery, we are free. And we are free. Government may not want to respect that, but we are free. This week is all about proving that we can do serious journalism work, and we can do it with a young crew. Hello, Spike, go on, get the bike. Call the police officer, watch your back. Hello, Spike, go on, get the bike. What I'm called to do is make sure that we fight for the poor. You can give a fancy speech, but that action that comes behind it is so much more important than what we say. If I see a piece of sh with a flag, I will keep put my foot in their ass. There's only one person that I could support, and that's Donald Trump. This is going to be the first step to us taking back the White House. I actually hope that Donald Trump wins. He's going to wake a lot of people up. You don't want that. Fear, hate, and violence are dividing our communities. I don't want Muslims here because the only thing they want is to kill us. If you're like me, you're wondering what's next. He's speaking my language. You have to deal with the reality that he could win. And if he do win, what you gonna do then? Start buying guns. Trump is trying to use this moment to divide us. We have to stand together against him. If you want to change anything, you need to be part of the process. This is what democracy looks like. This is how you change the injustices that are going on. Enough is enough, and it starts right now. That's what makes this country great. When people come together, we know how to tear walls down. My brothers and sisters, change is not coming. Change is right here, right now, with our people. This is not a moment, but this is a movement. America has a long way to go, but we're hoping that we can help her get to where she needs to be. I humbly accept your nomination.